What's up, guys? My name is Miles. And my name is Fez. And this is The Commodity. And today we're reacting to the Bald Eagle versus the Philippine Eagle, which is the strongest. It's funny because this has nothing to do with the country. <laughs> like, I it know. really doesn't. Like, it, it's... We're just talking about birds. Yeah, we're literally <laughs> talking about two birds. It has... I mean, yes, the Philippine Eagle represents the Philippines. I'm guessing that's their national bird. I don't know. Is it? Let us know in the comments. Yeah, let us know. And then, of course, everybody knows the bald eagle is America's national bird, which is definitely the strongest. <laughs> I, I, know we'll I know it's smaller. I know it's smaller because the Philippine eagle, I've read in the comments that it's the largest yeah. eagle in the world. So, Yeah. Uh, guys, if you like us and you like smiles and happiness and just I thought you were making fun of your name feelings, smiles, smiles just warm feelings inside go ahead and give this video a thumbs up help us with the YouTube algorithm it definitely helps get this video out to the masses we just hit 30,000 subscribers thanks to you guys we truly appreciate it we're trying to hit 15 billion by the end of the week uh, so yeah subscribe Subscribe. <laughs> Let's jump into this. We're obviously not gonna ever hit 15 billion, by the way. Says who? <laughs> we could be the first. American bald eagle versus Philippine. Okay, let's just, just be from... let's just be honest right here. <laughs> if you had to pick one from this picture, what would you pick? I mean, obviously the Philippine eagle is a beautiful bird, <laughs> but from this image, it looks like the American eagle is staring down the Philippine Eagle and the Philippine Eagle's like, oh sh <laughs> <laughs> like, like I mean, talk about like the most stereotypical look for like, you know, I'm a military, I'm, I'm a, a tough American. guy. The bald eagle definitely has the menacing look. I'm not dissing the Philippines by any stretch. Again, this is not about the countries. This is about two birds. Yes. So from this view alone, the bald eagle looks much more badass <laughs> in my personal opinion. Don't hate me. That's a funny picture though. They couldn't have done better. Fight between these two top predators. Eagles have held a special place in the cultures of many civilizations because of their impressive size and beauty. Used to symbolize royal power, from ancient Egypt to the Roman and Napoleonic empires, Why has YouTube been doing have appeared that a on lot coins, lately? standards, and weaponry. That's a fight dope. between the Philippine eagle and the bald eagle is something that anyone would be interested in watching. See, they're the Filipino there eagle. No Look, the Philippine eagle, or whatever you call it. Look good. Battlefield. That picture was just not fair. Okay, found in different come on, geographic. why are you so fast? The two species. So it looks pretty badass. In yeah, that in that picture, it looks so much better. Whoever did the last, like they <laughs> the put, they did one. it on purpose. Yeah, I guarantee you, as an American. Yeah. So they try to, but again, the the I guess it's just so iconic here. Yeah. That you just see the American eagle or the American eagle, the bald eagle. You're just like, first of all, it's not bald, but it just looks fat. It's got weight to it. Yeah are majorly found in different geographical regions and therefore making it hard to bring them together for a fight. The two praying bird species have unique characteristics and adorable physical features. Adorable. <laughs> Clearly recognized by its white head, brown body and hooked yellow. Have you ever seen a the bald, bald eagle, eagle before? Has been mm -hmm. a national emblem of like the outside of like a, of America a zoo. Since zoo. Mm -hmm. Seen it in Colorado. Although they are not bald, but rather have a white head in stark contrast to darker colored feathers. They are beautiful. This beautiful yeah. bird is readily found hunting Alaskan salmon, but exists all over the United States and Canada. The Philippine Eagle is one of the world's largest, most powerful birds of prey. Unfortunately, the Philippine Eagle is critically endangered due to poachers and deforestation. You know, that's unfortunate. Yeah. Why I, gonna, why, like, what, what makes you want to kill a bird like that? People are, people are crappy, and if they have the opportunity to put something on their mantle or uh, if they see medicinal benefits, because a lot of people had, like, the same concept with, like, elephant 
tusks and stuff mm-hmm. like that. They'll literally kill an entire elephant for its just tusks. for its tusks. Yeah. For to make ivory, uh, like things, or even grind it up and use it as a medicinal thing. So it's just people suck, is what it is. And then the deforestation is people suck again. Yeah. So, and to be the fair, the bald eagle was national almost national extinct too. Yeah. As it represents the strength, uniqueness, a love for freedom, Look and at those power legs. of the Filipino mm-hmm. people. That's like a baby's leg. Yeah. Is locally known as Haribon or Herring Iban, which means bird king. Agila meaning eagle. It's got and like Banner a crown meaning mm-hmm. kite. Description. Bald eagles are large predatory raptors that are recognizable for their brown body and wings, white head and tail, and hooked yellow beak. Their feet, which are also yellow, are equipped and with ugly. sharp black yeah. talons. Juvenile bald eagles look very different from adults. Oh, I didn't know that. They are almost either. entirely brown, with occasional white markings on the undersides of their wings yeah, and that chest. That's really cool. As the juvenile gets older, the bill turns from dark brownish black to yellow, it's crazy. and the head and mm-hmm. tail turn white. Bald eagles grow to about 2.5 to 3 feet. 0. 0.7 to 0. 0.9 meters. That's a big ass bird. A weight of 7 to 15 pounds, 3 to 7 kilograms, and they have an impressive wingspan of 7, seven feet, feet, 2 meters. Female bald eagles are larger than the males, but share the same coloration. <laughs> Aside from its strength and rarity, this bird of prey is notably recognized for its size. It is the largest living eagle in the world in terms of length. They can grow up to three feet four inches, 102 centimeters. How big is that compared to the bald eagle? What was the bald eagle? Bald eagle is up to three feet. Okay, so, so they're, they're about the same height. Have a wingspan of approximately 7.2 cool. feet. Well, the wingspan on the bald eagle is seven feet. Oh, okay, so they're like, I mean, we're, we're, we're splitting hairs. Splitting hairs. 2.2 meters. The female is typically larger than the male and can weigh up to an impressive 18 pounds. So, it looks like his hair's wet. So He's got a mullet. <laughs> so the other one got up to 15 pounds. So three extra pounds in a bird is... Probably quite a bit. Yeah. Eight it's, it's all in the legs. It's probably like really just has to do with what they have to hunt and stuff. By its nape adorned with long chocolate brown feathers and a shaggy crest. That is beautiful. A big mm-hmm. arched beak, long crown feathers... And they're two blue gray eyes. I still like that first picture. The bird also has a loud and high pitched noise that suggests its territorial and bold characteristics. Juveniles are known hear the to noise. beg for food oh, it's by a series yeah. of high pitched calls. It's like a Native Range American. Range and <laughs> habitat. Bald eagles prefer living in areas That's close gorgeous. to bodies of water mm-hmm. as their favorite prey is fish. They can be found in wetlands. That's like Montana coasts, or something. Near lakes or rivers and in marshes. When perching, roosting, and nesting, bald eagles prefer hardwoods like oak trees or coniferous like Look how trees. big their freaking nest is. They yeah. appear to select trees based on height and sturdiness. Bald eagles can be found across the entire United States. These eagles that. will also spread Neither down into northern Mexico. So it's got the the year or the the time of year. So year round, it's in all of these areas. Non breeding time, blue, and then breeding, it's in like Canada and stuff. Through most of Canada and into Alaska as well. Yeah, I saw it in Colorado. The That's probably of why. It's can really vary based always upon there. The time of year. The Philippine eagle is endemic to the Philippines and is found on parts of the larger islands of Luzon, Samar, Leyte, and Mindano. Philippine eagles inhabit remnant patches of primary dipterocarp forest, a family of resinous trees that are found in the old world tropics. I was about to say, I have no idea what he just said. <laughs> Like resinous something or other. I was like, um, I'm I'm an idiot. I have no idea what words he just used. Uh, let us know down in the comments. Have you seen one of these in person? It's it's a lot 
like for the U.S., I would say it's actually quite rare on an average person to have ever seen a wild bald eagle. Mm -hmm. Like I've seen them in shows and in like captivity type things because they were also going extinct. So a lot of eagles were kept in captivity to help the population to grow through breeding. So. Yeah. Pithecophica jefferi also occurs in second growth and gallery forest. Diet. I think the this vast is going to be the majority of a bald difference. eagle's diet consists of fish. They prefer habitats near water for easy fishing. Many populations will rely heavily on the spawning behaviors of fish, like salmon and trout, for their diet. Could you imagine a bird just coming down and pulling a fish out of the water? Yeah. Other birds compose the next largest portion of the bald eagle's diet. Look how. Look at this. They will feed on seagulls, talons. herons, ducks, geese, Dang. egrets, loons, sandhill cranes, and pelicans. Wow. Holy crap. Less frequently, bald eagles will prey on mammals. Some mammal species that are known prey to bald eagles include raccoons, rabbits, muskrats, beavers, deer fawns, wow. and harbor <laughs> seal pups. I didn't know they could go for that big of an Philippine animal. eagles feed mainly on medium-sized mammals, such as flying lemurs, palm civets, flying squirrels, and monkeys, giving them their other common name, monkey-eating eagles. That's crazy. Other prey includes rats, snakes, small deer, birds, and bats. So the Philippines eagle primarily is, is more like meaty foods. Yeah. And well, then the bald eagle is primarily fish. Which is meat. Right, but it's more of a lean meat. Yeah. He's he's working out. He's, he's working trying to get out. those that protein in. Individuals hunt starting from their nest. At the you mean like fatty meats, and right? Slowly like move red meat. Hill from perch to perch, before flying back up the hill upon reaching the bottom. They use this technique to conserve energy, because they are able to soar from perch to perch while looking out for prey. Pairs have been observed hunting together. One hmm. individual acts as a decoy, drawing the attention of a group of monkeys towards it. That's while unfortunate. Its partner captures a That's gangster, dude. <laughs> <laughs> Behave. Poor monkeys. Bald eagles are powerful flyers, soaring, gliding, and flapping over long distances. In one of several spectacular courtship displays, a male and female fly high into the sky lock talons and cartwheel downward together hmm. breaking off at the last instant to avoid crashing to earth i did not know that look at their capable claws, of floating dude. a bald eagle may use its wings to row over water too deep for wading though often solitary bald eagles congregate by the scores or even the hundreds at communal roosts and that's crazy sites, i had no idea particularly in winter when feeding at carcasses Bald eagles may push black and turkey vultures out of the way. I don't know if y'all have uh, vultures in Malaysia, but... Or the Philippines. Philippines, sorry. So sorry. Or Malaysia, for that matter. I don't know. Um, but here, oh my gosh. Like, it's against the law to, number one, hunt those. Yeah. Because they, they do clean, like, streets and stuff like that. I remember, uh, short story, uh, my grandfather... One of them got hit by a car, mm -hmm. and so it had a broken wing. But it would literally eat like they're huge. They're they're bigger than eagles. Yeah, I want to say because they're gigantic birds, and it would literally go and eat on the, his uh, crop. Mm -hmm. And so he had to go to the state to get an okay to hunt that that I, I don't uh, buzzard. I guess is what yeah. it was truly. And so it was. And then I remember going and hunting and my dad was going to the bathroom in the middle of the woods and he like, and I'm standing behind him and then I see the, the, the thing walk up and it kind of like spreads out its wings and kind of freaks out because it can't fly or it can kind of just flutter around. It can't like fly up high or anything right. like that. 
And my dad was freaked out. He was like, he couldn't find the gun or anything. It was hilarious. It was so good. But yeah, the, they're huge. So if a bald eagle or an eagle in general is bullying it around, yeah, that's impressive. And they're always in groups. Yeah. So. Pollution in the Philippine Islands without other predators made the eagles the dominant hunter in the Philippine forests. Each breeding pair requires a large home range of 25 to 50 square miles. That's crazy. Yeah. To successfully raise a chick. Wow. And thus the species is extremely vulnerable to the regularly occurring deforestation. Yeah, that, that makes a lot of sense. Yeah. The species flight is fast and agile, resembling the smaller hawks more than similar large birds of prey. Additionally, they have been known to attack inanimate objects for practice. What are you looking as well at? Well, as to attempt to hang upside down to work on their balance. Oh, wow. Life expectancy for a wild eagle is estimated to be anywhere from 30 to 60 years. That's cool. Wow. Now let's see who will win a battle between the American bald eagle and the beautiful Philippine eagle. I'm guessing the Philippine eagle. A combat Probably. between these two birds will definitely be a fierce one. Their habitat and feeding patterns also differ in a way that no enthusiast or researcher will confidently predict the outcome of a fight between the two. The winner will be determined by not only strength and size, but also ability to maneuver in the air. Just Speed tell us. I know, really. <laughs> There is no doubt that the Philippine eagle is stronger and also more potent than the bald eagle. However, bald <laughs> eagles are also smart, resourceful, and can defend themselves from any injury by the endangered Philippine eagle. Philippine eagles are known to seamlessly maneuver in any direction with high speed between trees in dense... Get it over forests. with. This behavior is enhanced by their physical characteristics. Though the bald eagle may be more intelligent, the Philippine eagle is likely to win a fight between the two. Okay. That's all for okay. today. Okay. I don't think birds do hunt, eat, fight each other <laughs> like that, to be fair. What do you think would work, uh, win between a gorilla and a hippopotamus? A gorilla. Hippo would destroy it. No, it wouldn't. Yes, it will. Oh, what an... It's the most dangerous animal in the entire world. Yeah, but they're stupid. Dude, they will... Have you seen the videos where they, like, take on alligators and they'll take on uh, rhinos and stuff? A gorilla would kill a hippo. I don't think so. Punch it in the face. I don't think gorillas know how to punch. Yeah, they do. That's not a punch, bro. <laughs> I'm gonna punch you. Ow! <laughs> <laughs> Guys, again, if you liked this video, give us a thumbs up. If you like me, subscribe. If you love me, definitely subscribe. You want them to love me, bro. That means that they subscribe. If you want to subscribe, subscribe. Uh, but again, throw some comments down or so, some suggestions. And comments down in for that comments, matter. Um, for some other videos for us to check out. We're running low on suggestions right now. Yes, we need suggestions. But this one was a suggestion, so we thank you for the people that suggested it. Yes. I think like 30 people suggested this video, so yeah. it was much appreciated. And with that being said, my name is Miles. And my name is Fez. Thanks for watching, guys. Peace. Out.